Hello friends, I am Dr. Gaurav. Today I am going to discuss refrigerant. The contents are introduction, classification of refrigerants, generation of refrigerants, properties of an ideal refrigerant, designation of refrigerants, refrigerant safety group, comparison of refrigerants. Next is introduction. Refrigerant is a substance that absorbs heat from a low temperature reservoir and transferring it to a high temperature reservoir. Low temperature reservoir means evaporator where refrigerant absorbs the heat. High temperature reservoir means condenser where refrigerant rejects the heat. Refrigerant is used as a working substance in refrigerating and air conditioning machine. Often we listen that gas has leaked from air conditioning system. It is not the gas. It is the refrigerant that has leaked from the air conditioning system. The first refrigerant used was ethyl ether. Classification of refrigerants. We can classify refrigerants in two types, primary and secondary. Primary refrigerants are those which can be directly used for the purpose of refrigeration. These refrigerants provide the necessary refrigeration by undergoing a phase change. For example, refrigerant used in home refrigerator like R134A. And another example is R22, which is used in air conditioning system. Secondary refrigerants are used for transporting thermal energy from one location to other. These refrigerants are used in certain situations in which we cannot allow the refrigerant to come in contact with the items being refrigerated. These refrigerants do not undergo phase change, whereas primary refrigerants undergo phase change, that is from liquid to gas and gas to liquid. These are also referred to as brines or antifreezes. If the operating temperature are above 0 degrees Celsius, then pure water can also be used as secondary refrigerant. For example, in large air conditioning systems, antifreezes or brines are used when refrigeration is required at sub-zero temperatures. Next is generation of refrigerants. The first generation of refrigerant is between 1830 to 1930. The refrigerants used in this generation are ammonia, carbon dioxide, sulfur dioxide, methyl chloride, ethers and hydrocarbons. The main issues with these refrigerants are toxicity, flammability and operating pressure. The second generation is between 1930 to 1990. The refrigerants used in generation is ammonia, CFC chlorofluorocarbons, HCFC hydrochlorofluorocarbons. So CFC and HCFC are introduced in this generation. The main problem with these refrigerants are they are responsible for ozone layer depletion and global warming. Third generation is between 1930 to 2010. The new refrigerant introduced in the generation was HFC, hydrofluorocarbons. The main problem with HFC is that they are responsible for global warming. Fourth generation starts from 2012. The refrigerant introduced in this generation is HFO hydrofluoroolefin. The main problem with HFO is that they are mildly flammable. Next is properties of an ideal refrigerant. We can divide the properties of an ideal refrigerant into four types. Physical properties of refrigerant, chemical properties of refrigerants, environmental properties of refrigerants, economic properties of refrigerants. First is physical properties of refrigerant. Refrigerant should have low value freezing point as compared to normal operating conditions. Otherwise, it will freeze during application. Refrigerant should have low value of condenser pressure so that power required for compression will be lower and it will result in low operating cost. Refrigerant should have high value of evaporating pressure. Otherwise, atmospheric air or moisture will leak into the system. Refrigerant should have high value of critical pressure, otherwise zone of condensation decrease. Refrigerant should have high value of vapor density or low specific volume, so it will require a smaller compressor 
एंड कंडेंसर ट्यूब्स यूज विल ऑल्सो बी इन स्मॉलर डायमीटर डायलेक्ट्रिक सेंट शुड बी हाई टू अवॉइड शॉर्ट सर्किट रेफ्रिजरेंट शुड हैव हाई वैल्यू ऑफ लेट एंड हीट ऑफ वेपराइजेशन सो डेट इट कैन एक्सट्रैक्ट मोर हीट पर के जी ऑफ रेफ्रिजरेंट एंड इट विल इंक्रीज सी ओ पी ऑफ द सिस्टम रेफ्रिजरेंट शुड हैव हाई वैल्यू ऑफ हीट ट्रांसफर कॉफिशेंट एज इट विल रिजल्ट इन स्मॉलर एरिया एंड लोअर प्रेसर ड्रॉप दिस मेक्स द इक्विपमेंट कॉम्पैक्ट एंड रिड्यूस द ऑपरेटिंग कॉस्ट रेफ्रिजरेंट शुड हैव हाई वैल्यू ऑफ थर्मल कंडक्टिविटी टू रिड्यूस द एरिया ऑफ हीट ट्रांसफर इन एवोपरेटर एंड कंडेंसर रेफ्रिजरेंट शुड हैव लो वैल्यू ऑफ विस्कोसिटी एज इट लीड्स टू हाई हीट ट्रांसफर कॉफिशेंट एंड फर्दर इट लीड्स टू स्मॉलर फ्रिक्शनल प्रेसर ड्रॉप रेफ्रिजरेंट शुड हैव लो वैल्यू ऑफ आइसेंट्रोपी इंडेक्स ऑफ कंप्रेशन सो डेट द टेम्परेचर राइज ड्यूरिंग कंप्रेशन विल बी स्मॉल नेक्स्ट इज केमिकल प्रॉपर्टीज ऑफ रेफ्रिजरेंट रेफ्रिजरेंट शुड बी नॉन टॉक्सिक रेफ्रिजरेंट यूज शुड बी सोलूबल इन लुब्रिएटिंग ऑयल इफ द ऑयल इज नॉट मिसिबल इन द रेफ्रिजरेंट यूज एंड इट इज हैवियर इट विल सेटल डाउन इन द एवोपरेटर एंड रिड्यूस द हीट ट्रांसफर देर फॉर ऑयल सेपरेटर्स आर टू बी एम्प्लॉयड रेफ्रिजरेंट शुड हैव लो सोलिबिलिटी इन वाटर अदरवाइज मोस्ट ऑफ द रेफ्रिजरेंट फ्रॉम एसिड्स फ्रॉम एसिड्स और बेसिड इन द प्रेजेंस ऑफ वाटर दिस विल कोच कोरोजन एंड डिट्रॉइड वॉल्स सील्स एंड मेटेलिक पार्ट द रेफ्रिजरेंट शुड नॉट रिएक्ट विद द मटीरियल यूज इन द रेफ्रिजरेशन साइकिल लाइक एवोपरेटर कंडेंसर ट्यूब्स कंप्रेसर कंट्रोल वॉल एक्सेट्रा नेक्स्ट इज इन्वायरमेंटल प्रॉपर्टीज ऑफ रेफ्रिजरेंट इन केस ऑफ लीकेज रेफ्रिजरेंट शुड बी इजली डिटेक्टेड अदरवाइज स्ट्रॉन्ग स्मेलिंग केमिकल्स मे बी एडिड टू रेफ्रिजरेंट रेफ्रिजरेंट शुड बी नॉन फिल्मेबल रेफ्रिजरेंट शुड हैव जीरो वैल्यू ऑफ ओ डी पी डेट इज ओजोन डिप्लेसन पोटेंशियल द ओडोपी ऑफ ए रेफ्रिजरेंट इज इज द रिलेटिव अमाउंट ऑफ डिप्लेसन टू द ओजोन लेर इट कैन कोज ओ डी पी ऑफ आर इलेवन इज फिक्स एज मैक्सिम वैल्यू ऑफ वन रेफ्रिजरेंट शुड हैव लो वैल्यू ऑफ जी डब्ल्यू पी डेट इज ग्लोबल वार्मिंग पोटेंशियल जी डब्ल्यू पी इज द रिलेटिव मेजर ऑफ हाउ मच हीट ए रेफ्रिजरेंट ट्रैक इन द एटमोस्फेयर जी डब्ल्यू पी ऑफ कार्बन डाइऑक्साइड इज वन नेक्स्ट इज इकोनॉमिक प्रॉपर्टीज ऑफ रेफ्रिजरेंट रेफ्रिजरेंट मस्ट हैव लो कॉस्ट एंड इजली अवेलेबल नेक्स्ट इज डेजिनेशन ऑफ रेफ्रिजरेंट ऑल द रेफ्रिजरेंट आर डेजिनेटेड बाय आर फॉलोड बाई ए यूनिक नंबर The number assigned to each refrigerant is related to its chemical composition, and the system has been formalized as ASRE, that is American Society of Heating, Refrigerating, and Air Conditioning Engineering, Standard 34. Broadly, the numbering system is as follows: triple zero series methane based, hundred series ethane based, two hundred series propane based, three hundred series cyclic organic compounds. 400 series geotropes 500 series azotropes 600 series organic compounds 700 series inorganic compounds 1000 series unsaturated organic compounds so first we will talk about fully saturated halogenated compounds these refrigerants are derivative of alkanes that is cnh2n+2 such as methane in case of methane the value of n is 1 so the formula is ch4 ethane c2h6 and propane c3h8 these refrigerants are designated by r x y z where x plus 1 indicates the number of carbon atoms y minus 1 indicates number of hydrogen atoms z indicates number of fluorine atoms the balance indicates the number of chlorine atoms only two digits indicate that the value of x is zero example r22 here we are ha only having two digits if we compare this with r x y z then the value of x comes out to be zero that implies number of carbon atoms is equal to 0 plus 1 that is 1 that is it is a derivative of methane y equal to 2 that implies number of hydrogen atom is equal to y minus 1 that is equal to 1 z equal to 2 that implies number of fluorine atoms is equal to z that is 
द बैलेंस इज इक्वल टू फोर माइनस नंबर ऑफ एच प्लस एफ एटम्स इट इज फोर माइनस वन माइनस टू इक्वल टू वन दैट इम्प्लाइज नंबर ऑफ क्लोरिन एटम्स इज इक्वल टू वन द केमिकल फॉर्मूला ऑफ आर ट्वेंटी टू इज सी एच सी एल एफ टू इट इज ऑल्सो नोन एज एच सी एफ सी ट्वेंटी टू हाइड्रोक्लोरो फ्लोरो कार्बन बिकॉज इट कंटेन्स कार्बन हाइड्रोजन क्लोरिन एंड फ्लोरिन the bro brominates refrigerants are denoted by putting an additional b example r13 b1 is derived from r13 with the replacement of one chlorine atom by one bromine atom its chemical formula is therefore cf3br so here we have replaced one chlorine with one bromine atom r134a here the alphabet a is small The chemical formula is C2H2F4. Derivative of ethane. Letter A stands for isomer. Molecules having same chemical composition but different atomic arrangement. Example of isomer R134 and R134A. The chemical structure name of R134 is 1122 tetrafluoroethane. and the chemical structure name of r134a is 1112 tetrafluoroethane if we look at the molecular structure we find that in case of r134 first carbon atom is having two fluorine and second carbon atom is also having two fluorine so the name is 1122 11 means first carbon atom contain two fluorine atom 22 means second carbon atom also contain two fluorine atom whereas in case of R134A first carbon atom contains three fluorine second carbon atom contain one fluorine atom so the name is 1112 that means first carbon atom contains three fluorine second carbon atom contains two fluorine atom next is geotropic refrigerant mixtures it is a blend of two or more refrigerants that shows temperature variation during boiling and condensation processes under constant pressure and behaves like individual components it is de designated by the 400 series it is also used in a large number of refrigeration applications such as r407c is used in residential air conditioners as an alternative of r22 and it has a composition of 23% r32 25% r12 R125 and 52% R134A to differentiate among blends having same chemical having same components with different proportion an upper case letter shall be added to designation for example R402A and R402B here A and B represents that these refrigerant contains same component but having different proportion of the, of these same components next azeotropic refrigerant mixtures it is a blend of two or more refrigerants that boil and condense at the constant temperature under constant pressure and behave like a single component whereas geotropic refrigerant behaves like like a individual component it is designated by 500 series it is used in large number of refrigeration applications such as R502 is used for cold storage purpose which is a mixture of R22 and R115 next is 600 series it has been assigned to miscellaneous organic compounds for example butane and isobutane the formula of butane is C4H10 and the formula of isobutane is also C4H10 but both of these are isomers so the isobutane is known as r600 small a in organic refrigerants these are designated by number 7 followed by the molecular weight of the refrigerant rounded off for example ammonia is designated as r717 as its molecular weight is 17 so here number 7 followed by the molecular weight at the molecular weight of the ammonia is 17 so the formula is r 717 when two or more inorganic compounds have the same relative molecular masses upper case letter a b c are added 
to them unsaturated organic compounds these refrigerants contain four digits first digit represent number of double or triple bond second digit represent total carbon minus 1 third digit represents total hydrogen plus 1 fourth digit represent total fluorine for example r123yf or hf4123yf hf4 means hydrofluoroolefin is having formula ch2 double bond cf cf3 and its chemical structure name is 233 tetrafluoropropene r1234yf molecular structure is given below as we can see that second carbon atom contain one fluorine third carbon atom contain three fluorine so the formula is 2333 that means second carbon atom contain one fluorine and third carbon atom contains three fluorine and there is double bond between two carbon atoms so the name is propene next is refrigerant safety group in this we are having solubility and toxicity if we move from 1 2l 2 and 3 then we are moving from no flame proposition towards higher flammability in toxicity we are having a and b a represent lower toxicity b represent high toxicity so here a1 represent no flame propagation and lower toxicity for an ideal refrigerant we want our refrigerant to be a1 next is comparison of refrigerants in this we have compare different properties of refrigerants like molecular weight normal boiling point critical temperature latent heat specific volume GWP, ODP, atmospheric life, and safety limit. Normal boiling point for R134A is minus 26.10 degrees Celsius. That means it will start boiling at this temperature corresponding to the atmospheric pressure. Thanks. Any question you can write to me, Gorav. Dot C item at the rate gmail dot com.